Greetings once again and welcome to my kitchen. In today's menu, I have mpu fish. Mpu is a bakosi dish made of plantain flour, fish, oil, and some African spices. Let's begin, guys. So to begin, I need plantain, I need fresh fish, jansa, four corner spice, African nutmeg, black pepper, garlic, ginger, onions, chili pepper, salt, and oil. So guys, here yeah, I just go ahead and I blend my dry plantain into flour. Like you see me do, just use your blender and blend, blend, blend until it is powder. Okay, and then you set that aside. Then you go ahead and blend the rest of your ingredients and set that aside too. Mpu fish is a very delicious dish, okay? My grandmother used to prepare this when I was still a little girl. But then I used to see how she did it. And yeah, am I presenting it to you guys, okay? Go ahead and put in the rest of your spices into the blender and blend into a smooth paste. While the spice is blending, I go ahead and marinate my fish with salt. I will season the fish with sea salt. I make sure I coat it properly with salt. Now I divide my spice into two. One part I use to marinate the fish. The other part I will mix it with my plantain powder to form a paste. Now I'm marinating the fish with my spice and I will set that aside. Make sure to marinate it properly. I will just set that aside then I will go ahead and form a paste from my plantain flour yes my plantain flour I'm just adding a bit of salt and the rest of my spices with some cold water I'm going to mix that into a paste while I'm doing this on the other side, I'm heating up my cookware with some oil in it. Getting ready for the fish, guys. So here is my pot, go ahead and add some oil in it and then you fry your fish inside that oil. Mm, the 
aroma. Yo, the aroma from this fish is something else, guys. Go ahead and make some pool fish, okay? Then you will know what I'm talking about. Okay? I will cover that and let it cook for about five minutes on both sides. Be very gentle with this process because you don't want to scatter your fish. Turn it, flip it over and let the other side cook for another five minutes. Now our fish is almost ready. You go ahead with your plantain powder paste. Yeah, I just added some chili pepper on it just to garnish it. Go ahead and pour that over your fish, okay? Like so. Back in the village, we use plantain leaves to cook in pool. Even this method also, we cook like this also in the village. But the most preferred method is the plantain leaf method. But since we don't have plantain leaves, so we make do with what we've got. Okay, guys? So you want to cover this and let it cook for another 10 minutes. While you cover this to cook, keep an eye on it, guys, so that it doesn't burn. And make sure to cook on low heat. Immediately you put your plantain powder paste, reduce the heat and cook on low heat. Look at that guys! It has sticking up. You can smell poo everywhere, guys. I am already salivating. <laughs> Go ahead and taste for salt, okay? You can add some. I did add a little bit here. Yeah? Our poo is ready guys. I did serve mine with some boiled yam. You can serve yours with potatoes, with plantain, with rice, whichever staple food you want to use. Go ahead and enjoy your poo fish. Thank you so much guys for watching. Please if you haven't subscribed to my channel, go ahead and subscribe. Hit the notification bell also okay. Until next time, I will see you again. Bye.